We've been pretty consistent. Uh, we've had a pretty good year, but you know, we're not satisfied. We're not content with it yet. Uh, we're trying to play for the highest possible playoff seed. Uh, you know, like we got to go out every night and then not take any games for granted. What's uh, Kevin's me message to you guys last night and today? Uh, well, last night, you know, he thought <clears throat> we played hard enough to win the game. Mm -hmm. Literally nothing went our way last night. And, uh, you know, some mental lapses down the stretch there defensively, but uh, you know we played really, really well and hard last night. But it just didn't go away. Did you find out anything about yourself and the fact that you had to play so many containers in a row, and that's what it's going to be like when you do it? Yeah, it kind of felt like this is a playoff series. You know, going and playing against a, a, a solid team every single night on the road, hostile environments. <coughs> uh, you know, if anything, we definitely. We learned from this and got better from this, watched a lot of film, and hopefully we can correct these mistakes next time we go on the road. So what is it about having a shoot around in the middle of a back-to-back? -back? <laughs> uh, well, the game was early yesterday, so it's not like we, we got in at you know, 2, 3 in the morning, mm -hmm. which we usually do. So you know, we, were, we were home by 11, so we didn't get in too late. So I think it was good that we just came in here and got some shots up and make sure we're focused for tonight and don't let that road trip haunt us again and lose at home. Taylor, how important is it to come in tonight not overlooking a team that doesn't have a good record and, and hasn't been playing the best basketball this year? Yeah, it's huge. You know, We're playing for something. They're not. And we're on our home courts. So we got to protect that. Uh, and then we've lost three in a row, so we got to get back on track no matter who we play.